the second half about to get underway, and it's been a close one so far. What can you say, LeBron James? What an impressive effort today. I know we've said this many times before, but I'll say it again. He had a great first half, just an explosive uh, offensive display there. At the end of the day, I wouldn't be surprised if we're talking about what a great second half he had. He can usually keep it going for all four quarters. Wall and Beal together in the backcourt. Pearson and Nene filling up the forward spots. And it's Gortat in at the five. That's the five on the four for the Wizards. You know, regardless of who starts the break, it seems like he's usually the one to finish it. And that's because of how well he attacks the rim on the dead run. Well, Nene is a player who can help you score in a number of ways. Solid jump shooter from the high post. He's also a high efficiency finisher around the rim. And he can throw down some ferocious dunks. He's got such good hands around the basket. He rarely allows those opportunities to slip away. Outside Pierce. And the jumper is on the mark. Pierce has got five points in the quarter. Cavaliers leading. And Nene, a capable scorer on the low block. Yeah, and you can run your offense through him down there because he can get scores. He can force double teams. He's a pretty good passer from the post as well. Those are nice attributes when you're throwing it down inside. I like his tenacity getting to the basket there, even though the dunk rattled out. 99 times out of 100, you'll get the dunk or the foul. Beal's shot is good. His shooting's been outstanding. Definitely one of the reasons his team is up in this game. Let's check out what Doris Burke has for us. Well, guys, Kyrie Irving, the number one pick overall back in 2011, a player who promised himself he'd play in the NBA when he was just in the fourth grade. He said that came from his father. Confidence, confidence, confidence. That's all my dad preached. He'd always tell me, Kyrie, you could be this. You could be that. My dad had more belief in me than I had in myself. Gentlemen. You know, it helps having people boosting you up, Doris. Thanks. The Wizards have gone four or six from the field since the start of the third. Pierce dishes the wall. Again, the Wizards good for two. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes played. On its way from Irving for two. Here's Thompson. Rebound, Washington. Nene's got six rebounds now in the game. There's Peel with the three. And that comes off the assist by John Wall. Wall's got his seventh assist here tonight. Got that bucket in in no time at all. But now... You know, as he continues to, to grow as a leader, having LeBron James there and some other veterans who come in should really help smooth that out for the young man stand up. Here's what Washington's going with right now. Dewan Blair, who's checked in for Gortat. Humphreys comes in for Nene. And Miller's subbed in for John Wall. Miller kicks to Beal. Pierce for three. And that one's good. Pierce has got 22. Oh, and for Irving, a chance to learn from the best player in the world. On winning more games, I think it'll really help his development as a player and a leader, too. That's guaranteed. Outside, Pierce. Fires the three. Cleveland's gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. Here's James. Raiders trying to break free. LeBron shot is off. Down low. Shot misses. Cavaliers go the other way with it. And he lobs it up toward the rim. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Cavaliers will retain possession. Quick hands and the ability to anticipate the opening to create a turnover. So valuable, especially for a guard as we see two tremendous talents with their ability to steal that ball away. And, of course, you look at the numbers. John Stockton, 3,265 steals over his career. Really a crazy number. Averaged over two a game, and even in his later years, he was a threat in that regard. Thompson outside. Trying his luck deep. Waiters passes to James. And another miss by Cleveland. 
Kevin, I didn't like that defensive effort at all, but they're lucky he missed it. Yeah, they were uh, very lucky defensively because there was some miscommunication there. They he left him wide open. Wow. And there's the call on Kyrie Irving. That is his first foul of the game. Pierce, wide open, he fires. That's good on the jump shot. And what jumps out at you guys, the assist total. I and mean, they have been dominant in that category. It's the ball movement, the player movement, a great rhythm to their offense. Clearly seems to me a different mindset between these teams. With the shot. Out to Miller. He gets it up. Washington leading now by three. On the court for Cleveland. Thompson and Verja at the four and five. Irving and Waiters, the guards. And it's James in at the three. Walls shot is off. Well, that defense went from four to no defense at all. Well, you don't see him miss that shot very often. When he's open like that, it's usually lights out. They get the rebound. And the shot's good from the name. And the Wizards lead by three. He got a great read of where that miss was going, and that allowed him to be the first guy to it and get the putback. And you can feel the, the pattern of this game, guys. They're, they're working it inside, dominating in the paint, getting good shots at will. Oh, oh, no. oh man, that was a real hard to know. I don't know that this is the time for that kind of flair. In a close game, the important thing is the two points, not the dramatic. Oh, come on, Clark. He had to go for it, didn't he? I'm with, I'm with you, Kevin. You can't fault him for that. I mean, just let him go. Who cares? Good D by LeBron. The Cavaliers trail by three. Nobody near Irving. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. And that's now 17 points for Kyrie Irving. And Wall. Oh, look out. Oh, 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 oh. It's not possible what we just said. Clark, is that possible? Not <laughs> is probable, it? but it is possible, partner. It's it possible. possible. Not oh, probable, but it, it is possible. I don't know what all that meant, but you're right, partner. Savage, that's that's the way to get some momentum on your side. Absolutely. Let's find out what Doris Burke has for us. Yes, Kevin, during that last break, I heard David Blatt as he addressed his team. He gave his guys the green light to keep firing from downtown, telling them, listen, I like the work you're doing out there. Keep finding those gaps on the perimeter. They're giving us open shots. As far as wall leadership, you know, he's seemingly been hesitant to, to lead his first few years in the league, but it's become more prominent the last few years as he's gained more confidence and he's grown more comfortable in his role. Outside Pierce. Releases. Yep, right through the net. Pierce has got 14 points here in the second half. What, what a display of offense we've seen today, and it's only getting better. Well, both defenses have been on their heels all day, and it's begun to take its toll. You could see that in his growth this past season. Brendan Haywood, he's checked in for Tristan Thompson. Irving is just to love. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. The defenders need to recognize and be alert to staying on him as we get into crunch time. Wizards leading by four. No one near the wall as he lets it go. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Irving again. It's Pierce. Irving with the ball. Down to five on the shot clock. Takes a three. The shot, no good. Excellent D there from Pierce. Wizards have gone six and twelve from the field here in the fourth, and even 50%. Here's LeBron. An excellent game we've seen from LeBron. He's got 32 points. All the steals he's collected only add to his impressive stat line. Yeah, whether he's picking someone's pocket or picking off a pass, he has been causing some mayhem out there for sure. This one. 
Cavaliers making a switch here. Thompson's checked in. Gortat. Back in off the glass. And the Wizards lead by far. Boy, they are passing the ball very crisply right now. They sure are. That's three straight buckets that have come off of assists. And a big play there to mute the crowd. Yeah, that one kind of took all of the life out of them there. Kind of quieted the voices in here, didn't it? Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Yeah, that's five of their last six baskets inside the lane. They have really established themselves inside. He kind of threaded the needle with that pass into the paint. Here's Beal. The kick out to Pierce. Out of bounds. Cleveland takes possession. Oh, that certainly could be costly. In a close one, those kinds of mistakes can really give the other team momentum. He's having quite the quarter here, guys. I mean, shooting the ball extremely well. Washington's gone ice cold from three-point land all four since the start of the final quarter. And Wall. Here we go now. Outside Pierce. Hooked away. Stolen by Thompson. And there's a call on James. That's his first foul. Terrific defensive play to cut him off and square up. And he took a shot. Excellent toughness to get in there. Clark, they'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see some long possessions out of them going forward. What a performance from Bill here. He has 17 points and just an amazing performance from downtown. Uh, he is leaning down the threes, guys. Yeah, and you know, and I think the key thing probably what the coach wants to see is a good shot. It's important to convert right here. And Cleveland making a change here. Haywood's checked in. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Wall. Now the feed to be it. The kick out to Pierce. And the clock. It falls! And with that basket, it happened. From deep LeBron. The shot no good. These are incredible rebounding numbers. I'm not sure if we've ever seen anything like this, Clark. Oh, that's for sure, Steve. I mean, a superhuman performance on the backboard. Well done. And so it's the Wizards with the W. They pulled off this win, Clark, with respectable performances on both ends of the...